welcome back to my channel or hello if you're new. Today I'm going to be doing another one of my celebrity beauty hacks and today I'm going to be doing Blake Lively. You guys requested her and I absolutely love her so I wanted to learn all about her beauty secrets and tips that she has shared. I did a ton of research and watched a bunch of her interviews and I found some really interesting ones that I think you guys are going to like. But before I begin, this is a super exciting video because this video is actually sponsored by Sony Pictures Home Entertainment. If you guys didn't already know, Blake Lively was recently in a movie called The Shallows that was out in theaters and I personally went to it two times because I was that obsessed. I went once with my friends and once with my family because I liked it that much. But I just want to share with you guys and talk a little bit about it. I thought this would be perfect. Since we are doing a video on Blake Lively today, why not share her recent movie that she was in that you guys need to see because it was so good. But I just wanted to share with you guys that the movie is actually coming out on Blu-ray and DVD September 27th. And if you guys already want to get it on iTunes or Amazon Video, it's actually already out. It came out September 13th. So definitely go check it out if you haven't already. But The Shallows is pretty much a thriller action-packed movie. It's about a girl, Blake Lively, who's named Nancy in the movie and a shark, a great white shark. Blake Lively is the main focus of the movie and I thought she did such a good job on acting because you were never bored during the movie. It was action-packed. There was never a part where I was kind of bored just sitting there. You were always at the edge of your seat, really excited to see what was going to happen next. And I really loved how Blake Lively was this strong, educated, smart, powerful woman in the movie. It was really inspiring as well. The Shallows movie is coming out on Blu-ray and DVD starting at only $14.99 and I definitely recommend the movie. I will leave all the information as well as the links for the movie in the description box so make sure you go check that out if you guys are interested. Let me know if you guys already watched the movie and what was your favorite part about it. Let me know by leaving a comment down below because I would love to hear about it. I definitely need to recommend that one to you guys. It's definitely one of my favorite movies I watched this year by far hands down. But that being said, I hope you guys enjoy this beauty hacks video. Thumbs up if you guys want more and who do you want me to do next? Leave a comment as always down below telling me who you want me to do next. And I decided to make a playlist for you guys of all my other celebrity beauty hacks so it's just easier to have them all together. So if you guys want to see all the other celebrities I did, check my playlist in the description box. But that being said, let's just jump into the hacks. One of Blake Lively's skincare hacks is to have a good moisturizer. In the summer, she goes for a lighter moisturizer while in the winter, she really focuses on hydration. But something all her moisturizers have is SPF because she thinks it's really important to constantly have some protection on. Something Blake Lively does to keep her skin looking so perfect is she does this DIY home remedy and I'll leave the exact ingredients and recipe or little concoction down in the description box so go check it out if you're interested. But what she basically does is she takes a bowl of boiling water and then she adds some rosemary leaves, some thyme leaves and then what she also does is she'll drop three to four drops of essential oil and she'll just stick her face in it and just she finds it just cleans her pores, it cleans her face and it keeps her skin looking really flawless. This next beauty tip that she does is she likes to throw on glitter during the holiday season. So she'll either wear glitter nail polish or something she likes to do is she likes to add glitter on the eyes because it makes her eyes pop, she says. I'm just using the NYX Shimmer Roller Ball. I definitely recommend it. It's so nice. I just have this brown one. It has specks of gold in it, which I really, really enjoyed. But that's something that she definitely likes to add to just have a little pop during the holiday season. This next beauty hack she actually learned from all her makeup artists and she said that something that she likes to do is add a tiny pop of turquoise on the inner rim of her eyes to make them stand out. And she has I think like blue or greenish eyes and I definitely think that will make your eyes pop out. But I also think this is a good tip for even people that have brown eyes like me. You know, you can use it too girl. This next beauty hack is good for girls that have thin lips like Blake Lively and also myself I must say and what she normally does is she likes to take a lipstick color that's a natural pinky shade and I'm just using an Urban Decay one and then she takes a gloss a shiny gloss color and dabs it in the center of her both her top and bottom lip and just blends it in a bit and this just basically gives you the illusion of bigger pouty lips by reflecting the light off of it so I definitely recommend if you have smaller lips or even if you have bigger lips and you just want it to look bigger, definitely do it. I really enjoyed it. I just used a gloss from Makeup Forever and it had really nice shine into it. It had some gold specks of sparkle and I think it just looked really pretty. 
this next beauty hack is a weird one, but it's pretty interesting, I must say. And Blake Lively learned this from her mom because she has done it before. And basically, if you don't have blush or something and you have an Advil, you can use Advil as a blush. So all I did is I just took a little bit of water in my spray bottle. I sprayed the Advil so it gets a little bit wet. And then the color comes completely off. So you can just put it onto your hand, as you guys can see here. And then you're just going to take it and dab some onto the apples of your cheek. And then just take a brush and blend it all out and I think it's a really nice color to be completely honest and if you ever just don't have blush and you really want blush then just take an Advil out of your purse and use that as blush and she also did say that she does like to add a little bit of blush on the tip of the nose as well Blake Lively's hair is flawless and one of her hair hacks that she always does when she finishes a shower and lets her hair dry almost till it's dried completely but not fully she'll take her hair and put it into a very tight ballerina bun and she lets her hair naturally dry and then once she wakes up she says it really gives you a nice wave to your hair especially if you have naturally wavy and curly hair this just really gives it that nice texture so I definitely recommend it and it's something that I'm definitely going to start doing as well this next beauty hack is for her hair as well and it's another weird one and she actually uses mail for her hair and she swears by it. She puts it on the ends of her hair to protect her hair and this is something that her mom also taught her and she just says that it protects the hair and I actually tried it that night and it made my hair super moisturized the next day. If she is not doing a male hair mask, she will do a coconut oil hair mask and apply it to the ends of her hair as well and just keeps it in for a bunch of hours. And she says this keeps her hair really moisturized and alive as well. One of her beauty hacks for the red carpet is lash glue. So she says she's always worried if she's going to have a slip or her dress is going to fly up. So if you have something, she said that what she does is she'll put a little bit of lash glue and put the outfit over on top. So this avoids any slips or something like that. And I tried it with my romper and it really did stick, which I thought this was so unique. And I'm definitely going to use it one day if I ever need to. That is all for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and click that subscribe button. And if you guys didn't know, I do have Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. So go join me on that side of the world because I'd love for you guys to talk and you guys can see my daily life and all that stuff. But I hope you guys are having a fabulous day, evening, or night whenever you're watching this. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye!